I would love to have a soundboard. Oh, my hiney. There is, uh, when we first looked at like buying these things, yeah. Road had one. It was like a bit too, it was like 800 bucks. It was essentially what it did, but it had like a bunch of cords. But the thing that was the biggest thing, and they had 16 like light up buttons. Yeah. Press it, it puts a little track, it starts the noise. I'm like, do we get a soundboard? I don't know what we'd use it for or what they would be, but I think it would be hilarious to have one. Look at this. See these little buttons there on the side? Oh my god. Like, I don't give a shit about all the other things. I just know there's eight buttons. You can put any sound you want. Press it, it bleeds into the podcast. I'd love to be able to press a button that was just like, WWWT <laughs> at gmail.com. <laughs> You're like, oh, thank God. Thank God. Just See, I it. even said it wrong as the gag. <laughs> <laughs> WWD po- WWWT podcast. You're saying WWD40 <laughs> podcast. <laughs> I G- can't <laughs> say it. Why is our email address a fucking like, labyrinth? Oh, it is. I think, it's, I think the problem is it's the www.com. Or whatever you normally would do. WWWT podcast at gmail.com. What a nightmare. It looks right written down. Just saying it's an absolute jumble of words. Once you say it, you go, oh, it's actually, it's very violating. (laughs) God, I've been abused by an email. Oh, a chill runs through me each time I say it. And I go, ugh, don't, nobody send an email. Don't do that. Don't use that. (laughs) My name's Carl. (laughs) My name's Oscar, and this, and this is Who Would Watch, watch this, this, but not, not but we're not, not doing, doing it. that. We're doing, doing a different, different thing, thing today. today. Welcome to Who Would Watch <laughs> This, the podcast where we're just, we're just, we're bitter, okay? We're not happy. I'm not happy. No. I was promised a, at least, like, a bit of closure. Uh, we did not realise Fast X would be such a part one. Yeah. We really thought we were putting ourselves through the ringer mm. <laughs> to to have closure. And yet we're left with a cliffhanger that should not be a cliffhanger. Yeah. So for today, we figured, you know, we'll give you we need a bit of closure, but I think also the audience has a bit of closure. <laughs> I think everybody just needs needs a break. Yeah. You know? And that's what we're doing today. Break of Fast and Furious, because if not, we're 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 no. We're taking our pedal off the brakes, putting it on the accelerator, mm. driving back into the franchise. Yeah, it's it works both ways. If you want a break, but also if you want more Fast and Furious content, this is what we're giving you. <laughs> <laughs> we don't know what's going to happen in three years. Quite frankly, Carl's looking ghastly. He might. <laughs> <laughs> it's real. It's so true. I look sickly most days. So <laughs> to feel good today, wow, wow. <laughs> Ugh. Hey, hang in there, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I swear, if you just let me have a kidney. <laughs> I'm running on none right now. Isn't that, nut- oh. Isn't that nutty? I've got two livers. One, no kidneys. You got a lot of spleens, though. You got like four spleens. No, I got, I'm, I'm holding two. <laughs> <laughs> just gobble them down and hope they fall into place. <laughs> Carl, okay, so here's the rule. Here, here's the gang. Here's the idea. Yeah. We're going to try and make up Fast 11. With the, with the information we've been given. I feel like we're pros now. We yep. know the characters. We know the beats. Yep. We know probably how this is going to end. Yeah, so I think we can do it. Yeah, I think so. I think we can write one. Yes. Um. First off, though, we need to have a title. Yes. We've just had Fast X. Yes. What do you want to call this one? Now, last week we said Fast XXL. Yeah. I think I think we have to... Do we to, like that? I, I think we do like that. However, yeah. it's too consistent, and therefore it probably isn't going to be called that. What about fast CCMX? Ooh, <laughs> what, just what's Roman that? numerals? Two... 252, <laughs> I think? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah, I don't... I think it could be like... the. Uh, it might just be like Fast and Furious Roads End. What do you yeah. reckon? Or Pump on the Brakes. Fa- Hard I, I stop. feel like it would be like uh, Fast and Furious stop sign. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like they might go back to the fate of the Furious, kind of like jump into that again. Yeah. The end of the Furious. Yeah. Do you reckon? Yeah, the end of the Furious. Yeah, I think it could be something like that. Yeah. Shall we call it that? I think so. The end of the Furious. All right. Today, Oscar and I are making the end of the Furious, which, believe it or not, got a six on IMDb. <laughs> 
a 2.8 on Letterboxd. They didn't love it. No. But hey, critics also didn't like it, and they gave it a 30% on Rotten Tomatoes. It's already made $2.6 billion. Good on it, huh? We would, we were undercut by Avatar 9. <laughs> Who knew? Who knew? All right, Carl. We need to get into where we're at. So let's just, like, recap, essentially. Uh, Dom and Little B are dying on the bottom of the bridge. The dam, sorry. Yeah. The Ludacris, the Gibbs, uh, Ramsey, and Han have crashed in a plane... We don't know, but... Behind a behind hill. Behind a hill. <laughs> don't look behind it, but it, it might have happened. We've also got uh, um, Cypher, Letty, and Gal Gadot in Antarctica. <laughs> <laughs> yep. We've got Jason Momoa at the top of the dam, yes. having just blown it up. His offsider, which was some beefcake man. Mm. Um, who else is there? We've also we've also got the Shores. <laughs> oh yeah, we've also got the Shores. We've also got Dwayne, yep. uh, Helen Mirren, but she's part of the Shore gang. Yeah, we got Rita Moreno. Oh, and we've also got Brie Larson. Yes. Um. So yeah, we've got a whole we've got a lot to cover. Okay. First things first, we need to get out of this pickle. I do like this now. The writers' group because you know for yeah, a no. fucking fact they're like, all right, that ended there. The damn. Well, how are we getting out? They definitely haven't thought it through. No. I reckon they'll be listening to this podcast to try and yeah, get themselves out of a write scenario. Write this down, guys. Send us a check. Here's how we open. Yes. Okay. Fast X. Mm-hmm. We know. Okay, it opened mm. in Fast Five. Yes. Right. This one's taking place. In Too Fast, Too Furious. Okay, shit, we're doing a flashback How already. do we feel about that? It's, I, I, I'll, I'll go with it because I, yeah. I've got no way of stopping this. It's about what Tyrese Gibson was doing during the Too Fast, Too Furious. Yeah, okay, okay. okay. Here's what so I'm So the thinking. Gibbs is a titular character now. He's kind of the, the main focus of this series now. Yeah, because I think... Here's the thing. I want to I wanna kill some characters today. <laughs> I want to cause a little bit of chaos. Dare I say, this fucking player that goes behind the hill, yeah. they all die. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm just there right now. If the film opens like that, that's bold and brave. Yeah. So here's what I'm thinking. Yes. Because we know in Too Fast, Too Furious, Tyrese Gibson was in a lot of trouble. Yes. Yep. He, he was under house arrest in a monster truck-esque scenario yes. or something like that. I'm going to posit he used to get in trouble for throwing mattresses out of windows. Okay. Then jumping from the window onto the mattress for safety Mm -hmm. and then stealing the mattress. Okay. Okay. Classic mattress dealer. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just a little bit of that, right? And then he would put said mattress onto a car, Mm -hmm. drive away on it. Police chase him. Yes. Right? And that's your opening little race. Okay, yeah? okay. Except also maybe, I don't know, maybe he rides past Vin Diesel at some stage. You yes. Know? Ties it together a okay, little. Okay, okay. Yeah? I'm back into it. And now we're back in Fast X. Oh, okay. Bold. Right? Yep. The plane's going to crash. Yes. <laughs> Tyrese Gibson has a mattress. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, everybody with me. Han jumps on the mattress. Yes. The hacker jumps. Ramsey. On, Ramsey jumps on the mattress. They Ooh. go to jump. Ludacris just misses <laughs> going onto the mattress. They fall out of the plane mm. safely on a mattress. Yeah. Ludacris <laughs> brutally falls <laughs> out of the plane. <laughs> I can't stress to you. We see it in full IMAX theaters. We see Ludacris' oh, body. None of it's in IMAX until this moment. <laughs> then it goes to IMAX for this shot. Ludacris coming down in the plane, breaks, burns, blows up. We oh. see his limp body trying to get out of that. Guess what? What? He gets hacked. <laughs> I'm thinking more like propellers go everywhere mm. he's sliced shoulder <laughs> neck knee crutch just intensely right yes han gibbs ramsey mm. comfortably laying on the bed mm. there's a sheet and they pull it over themselves and the three of them make love oh okay. cut to the end of the furious <laughs> that's that's your intro right okay. there what do you reckon I, I'm d- I'm down. Okay, we killed Ludacris. We've killed Ludacris. That's an arc that yep. I think will pay off. Yep. We've set up a flashback, which we know all of these movies love to connect themselves. Mm-hmm. I think it was worth connecting the second one. Yes. Because that's the most disconnected. Yes. Yep. Um. Oh, you know who we also need to bring back? Mm. Everybody from Tokyo Drift. Oh, of course. <laughs> Everybody. Everybody. They're all back. I don't know how we're going to do it. <laughs> um, we're going to goddamn try. Now, this is great. I'm glad that now Han and Ramsey and 
the Gibbs have kind of got a thing. Yeah. What's the go now? Because Han's, you know, thinking he's a single man. What's going to happen now with Gazelle? <laughs> <laughs> if this threesome rocks up and he sees Gazelle, things yeah. are going to be... Wow, we've already got ourselves into I a know, nice we've got ourselves truck. into a I nice love one. Square. Yeah, we've also got we've also got things that we need to... You know, there's still a few questions out there. Yes. Okay, so I'm thinking after after this moment, um, Tyrese and Ramsey need to turn to Han and they need to go, what happened to that little assassin that you raised? Yes. Um, and I think Han needs to go dead. Yeah. She died. She died. She died. So that's covered. Great. So tick on him. Woohoo. Yep. Great. I totally forgot about her. <laughs> <laughs> that is crazy that they just bro- brushed over that for X. Yep. So. Oh my God. Dead. Full dead. Yeah. Full dead. We might. Let's and- go down the list. Who else is dead? <laughs> <laughs> um, That's when um Han goes, hey, didn't you used to know Eva Mendes as well to Tyrese Gibson? And that's when Tyrese rips and goes, nope, she's she's dead. dead. She's dead. I can't stress this enough. She died in Miami. We actually yeah. see her in another flashback. Yeah, they try to do the mattress stunt. Guess what? Doesn't work. It's a double. It's a it's a it's a double cross. The mattress full of beads. <laughs> <laughs> I th- yeah. <laughs> Yeah, the I like to think that the mattress had too much spring. Oh, so when she <laughs> fell onto it, she then flew up again and then just landed on the road dead. <laughs> like <laughs> just too much spring. Yeah, yeah, too much yeah. spring. Okay, we got which rid brings of us to the fact that maybe it was a koala mattress. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. This <laughs> don't even try that shit. Yeah, okay. we won't. They, koala mattress doesn't yeah, sponsor they've this. Said they've, said, they've tried to send us emails. They're not happy about yeah. us. Okay. That's them save. Let's go back to Dom and Little B. They are at the bottom of a dam. <laughs> there is burning everywhere. The, the yeah. thing's going to fill dam the water. Is yeah, a- they haven't got a car either. They haven't got a car. I think we need to be saved by people. Because well, I just don't think... Okay, it's either we go down two paths. Either someone saves Dom and Little B, or Dom just grabs Little B and turns into a car. I, don't, <laughs> I, I think at this point, if Dom was a Transformer, I wouldn't be surprised. How bold would it be to kill them off? <laughs> <laughs> Dom's gone. Little B's gone. Do we think... No, they've got to they've be saved. They've got to be saved. Do we think The Rock should save them? Oh, you know what? I would say yes, but only yeah. because I want to see Dwayne and Vin Diesel film a scene together. I don't. Think oh, they still don't I, film a scene I, I, together. Yeah, I think he's going to be like in a black mask. He's like, hey, Vin, I saved you. Yeah. <laughs> just like, wow, thanks, Dwayne the Rock Johnson. <laughs> I like to think maybe the Rock comes into the dam on a hang glider. Yes. Just big arms. Um, he's shot like from from a down angle. Mm-hmm. Uh, he didn't come to set that day. No, only, only Vin and Little B were on set, mm-hmm. and maybe just pick some up. Do we think? I think that works well. Yeah, yeah. I then will say this right now. He's gonna drop them off, and then immediately they will not see each other till the end of the film. Well, I think. Does the rock? Okay, so we've also got, at the end of Fast X, yes. The Rock is also threatened by Jason Momoa. Yes. We also need to work out what, what we want to do with Jason Momoa. If he sees the, the Hobbs, he, the other thing that we need to do in this movie, we have to tie up Hobbs and Shaw as well. Okay, <laughs> so there's there's that. There's that too. Like just tie up their storyline and Hobbs and Shaw? Yeah, we either need to have them like make out or find out who the villain was. <laughs> I, vote make, I vote make out, but yeah. let's get on to that. Now... So Jason Momoa sees The Rock. Yes. Save Vin Diesel yes. and Little B on a hang glider. Yeah. How would he feel about that? I think he's feeling angry. Now, I do think he needs to now get a MacGuffin. He needs mm. to get something that's going to fuck up things. What has he? What did he try and get in the last one? Just a bomb. I no. think, let's say for this one, he tries to get a chip. Yeah. This chip can control minds. Oh. <sighs> It's not a bad op, yeah. to be honest. If we haven't... Okay, so they've gone to space. Yeah. What if... Do we think that maybe there should be a supernatural element? Oh, you're not wrong. Okay, you're... What you, if it's you, an egg that can raise the dead and he wants to raise his dad? You know, okay. his dad alive. Okay, yeah, no, I fuck with that. And you know what's great about that egg? It can bring back Ludacris. <laughs> it can bring back Ludacris. <laughs> it can bring back Eva Mendes. It can bring back... Who else is dead? Oh, uh, <gasps> fifth one. This is amazing. Yes. Who has the egg? I reckon it's Charlie Theron, and she's brought back Giselle. Oh, chills. Do you do chills. you reckon she's hacked the egg? 
She's hacked the egg. Okay, this is this is this works. This yeah. is really good. Right. Okay. okay, so I reckon they're able to hack the afterlife. Yeah. Let's get rid of the egg. Yeah. Whoever brought that up, idiots. It's right. a MacGuffin, but they can hack it. So yeah. what, wait, 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 wait. What are they hacking? Okay. Dare what I say if, the egg's back in the game? <laughs> an egg would be good. <laughs> it is a round object, and that's what they usually need. But yeah. usually it also needs to be split in half. Yeah. A cracked egg, if you will. It can. It can be cracked in the egg. Do we think it should be the first ever Fabergé egg? Was a hackable system to the afterlife. Yes, yes. All right, we need another flashback. He, but that's back at. Let's... But here's the other thing that we also because we need Shelley Theron and Ramsey to have a hack off. Yeah. Don't like we do. We need that. I think they should both hack each side of the egg. But okay. This is good. Let's let's get the rules down. So okay. So, uh, Cipher Charlie Theron has fa- has got an egg that can be hacked and bring people back to life. Jason Momoa is like right. I try to kill Dom. I'm sick of this. I'm going to bring about my father, which ties back to the fourth one. Mm, that's good. That's They that's all want great. the egg. Everyone wants the egg. Everybody needs the egg. Yeah. Okay. I, I think every character, how about this egg can only kind of be used like a couple of times. Yeah. So like each character kind of wants someone. Yeah. So I think, let's say the egg has only ever been allowed to be used. Let's say it can only ever be hacked three times. Yeah. Like a monkey's paw will give you three wishes. Yeah. Okay. Or a magical egg that we hacked gives you three people back. Mm, great. Yeah. Okay. So it's already been used on Giselle, believe yeah. it or not. What a waste. <laughs> <laughs> Imagine Cypher yeah. going for a Rolodex like, okay, who do I... Well, Giselle was quite popular. I think, you know what? She should be back in their franchise. Also, when you hack the afterlife, on your way back to life, you get to pick a special skill to have that you didn't have before. Oh, good. And Giselle's picked driving a submarine. Oh, good. That's... <laughs> Just so that makes sense as that well. That makes sense, yeah. Yeah? Okay. So cool. that's that's good. Okay. All right. Um. So it's been used once, which means we've got another two uses. Yeah. Do we say it's been used once before mm. as an example... So the audience knows. We've got a rule of threes. Yes. Okay. Should we say this is really what saved Letty from, oh, from four? That's huge. Do we think? Yes. And it gives you amnesia. So Gazelle has oh, amnesia. That was her, so her superpower. <laughs> what? Letty's superpower? Was, wait, wait. They were on the way back to the to life, they were like, you can pick any superpower you want. And Letty goes, I'd love to have forgotten. <laughs> I'd love to have forgotten. The past of my life. Oh. I don't want to go back into the life I had. I'd love to forget. <laughs> okay, that's cool. So you don't want it to be amnesia. So Gazelle doesn't know about Han. It's up oh, to you. is that what you were going that's for? Going that's for. better. Okay, cool. Okay, <laughs> cool. Better. All right, sweet. So, okay. so the egg gives you gives you a power, but also you've got amnesia. Yes. Okay. So this is so basically. Okay. We've set the stage. We've got. But a set it piece. needs to be the rock needs to. I think tell Dom he needs to get the egg. Yes. So, the rock goes, Dom, I've got, they've just gotten off the hang glider. Yeah. All right. Tyrese, Gibson, Han, and um, Ramsey, they roll up in a car. Yep. But it's just the mattress with wheels. Yeah. Yeah? Classic, yeah. A classic, you It's kind of wet without, with kind of all the cum, you yeah. know? It's a, bit, it's a bit gross, but, you know, a car's a car. Oh, it was a real sodomized mattress. <laughs> oh, yeah. So you know it has driving powers. <laughs> Uh, I like to think Han's a bit of a MacGyver as well. So oh, he can yeah, just fashion things. He can, he can fashion stuff. Um, they are all back together. Yes. Now, obviously, we have to instantly split them up again. Yes. Because um, nobody enjoys acting with Vin Diesel. No, no, of course. So I think Jason Momoa, this is where Jason Momoa goes back. Because he's like, okay, fuck. He is aware of the egg somehow. He's... I think he has... I think his to-do list was make Dom suffer, make Dwayne the Rock Johnson suffer, <laughs> get that egg back to say my dad. No, Weird I... to-do list, but go on. I think it should be... Oh, brilliant. This is what I think we should do. Yeah. Okay. Tyrese goes, we got here safe and sound. Mm. Vin goes, but what about ludicrous? Mm. Tyrese goes, oh, very dead. Yeah. He goes, oh my God, we can't continue without Ludacris. He's a part of the family. Clever, clever. The we rock- already have three hackers. What will we do <laughs> if we lose him? The Rock goes, oh, I know how you can bring back Ludacris. Mm. I've heard of this egg yes. that can bring back anyone from the afterlife if you hack it enough. Yeah. Yeah. Jason Momoa hears this on the radio, on the radio, yes. and goes, "I could bring my dad back." Huge, right? The Rock goes, "That egg 
just brought Giselle back to life mm. and it's hidden in this exotic country and oh. now we get to pick our country. Oh, this is huge. Okay. All right, let's look up. So they've done London. Oh, no, no, we're just doing a random country Oh, generator. you want to do a random country generator? Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, people love a blockbuster set in... Madagascar. Thoughts? <laughs> huge. <laughs> I've never seen a film set there. <laughs> Never. Okay. No trilogies have been set there. So wait, the eggs in Madagascar? Um, that's where Giselle has hidden it. That's where she found the submarine. Yes. And she said, "This egg is." Who do we think brought Giselle back to life? Oh, Charlie's Theron hacked it. Yes. I don't know why she would bring Giselle back to life. Should we say Charlie Theron was around in the background of the fifth? Yeah, she she was aware of Giselle. She knew she was like pretty good at stuff, you know. Yeah. Yeah. So I think. Hey! The, hey! Oh. Hey! Hey! We don't need to answer it. No, no. These, these, some of these films haven't done that. No, no. Because here's the thing. Yeah. Charlie Theron mm-hmm. killed Vin Diesel's baby mama. Yeah. Right? So we need to address that. Yeah. That, that she is not a hero. Yeah. Right? Charlie Theron's not a hero. So does she still think that's... Oh, that's another person we could potentially bring back to life Yeah, we could. Well. We yeah, could this bring is back huge. The... This is huge. Yeah. But because it's all about family mm. and we need a reason for Shelley Strong to join the family, mm. is she Giselle's sister? Oh my God. Chills. Do we think? <laughs> yeah, I think so. Do we think? I think so. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. So now we're all going this to Madagascar. Great. We haven't specified, but the budget's $5 billion. Oh, of course. Of course. We're starting in Madagascar. The most high end place a, you can be. It costs a lot to film there. Let's get That's why ca- they animated. That let's series. get our characters right. So we've got we've got Letty, uh, Cipher, and um, Gal in yep. Antarctica. They're yep. still there. We've got Dom, Han, the Gibbs, uh, and Ramsey, yep. Dwayne, yeah, and I guess Hobbs and Shaw are somewhere else. But for now, let's say we'll focus on the Shaws in a sec. Yeah. Yep. Well, let's say we've got our gang. Yeah. They go straight to Madagascar. So do Jason Momoa. They drop off little B. With somebody, do you want Little B to be on the on the mission? Do you no, want no, B? Little B gets dropped off to be with Brian. Cool, yes. and you know what happens? We yeah. get okay. They go to drop off Little B to Brian, yeah. right? Because this is the last time that they'll they'll acknowledge, you know, everything that happened with Paul Walker. Yeah, Vin Diesel's going to open the door. Mm. It's going to go the um. When I see you again. We don't see Paul Walker, but he's got a head double. Yeah. We see the back of him. Mm-hmm. Right? And they use a little bit of spliced dialogue that says, I love each and every one of you. And yes. They go, that's beautiful. And they close the door and they say, we'll see you later. We're going to Madagascar. Go, We're off to Madagascar. We'll see you later, Brian. <laughs> and the two Brians turn around. They go, thanks. <laughs> Let's acknowledge that there's two people called Brian in one room. Yeah. I think it would be reminisced not to. I think so. We've got little B out. We've got little B out of the way. Cool. Easy. Done. We're in Madagascar now. We need a set piece. Okay? We do. But I think we need... A, okay. I think we need to get the girls there. Yes. We've. I think this series is split off a lot of people. You want to get everyone back involved. But I just don't think they work well together. I don't think they like each other. I think that's an insane thing. Letty... Cypher and Gazelle. What are they talking about, yeah. huh? So I think this is, they all hop onto the submarine. Yeah. Letty surely asks Giselle, what are you doing here? Yeah. We then hear about the egg a second time. Gotcha. Because you might have forgotten. Yeah, you might have forgotten. Rule of threes. Yeah. You're not going to remember unless there's multiple conversations about the single MacGuffin. That's good. If we can, can we cut back to Ludacris's deceased body? You know, just kind of cut it in for like five seconds. We need another IMAX shot. Yeah. We haven't had an IMAX <laughs> sequence since his death. Yeah, so. just kind of cut it in there. He's dead. Remember that. Anyway, back yep. to the submarine. Just they, so they know. They, so what? Like, Letty goes, hey, Dom, I have just found Gazelle and uh, Cypher. We're in a submarine. Do you need a lift? He's like, yeah, to Madagascar. Oh, and this is on the other end. What do you mean Giselle's there? Mm. And then uh, we see Han turns around and looks to the camera mm. and is like, <gasps> what? <laughs> That, so that's there. Yes. You know? It's there. <laughs> so we know. And he we get, knows. And listen, while we're at it, let's add some comedy. We get the Gibbs kind of sort of pushing the mattress out of the submarine. The evidence, if you will. You know? <laughs> I think, okay, in terms of... What's his, what's the g- dynamic of the Gibbs without Ludacris? Um, if anything, he's got a lot of confidence. Maybe he's in mourning, but dare I say, no. He's actually his own man. He actually is now... I think he's gotten rid of his abuser. Yeah. I think... It, I genuinely... He's gotten rid of his bully. Yeah. 
I think Ramsey now sees the value of, of the I Gibbs so. and they've fallen in love, I maybe? I think so. A bit more strong, you know? Yeah. All right, Ramsey and the Gibbs, you know, kind of getting a bit more together. Good I think for them. maybe like a real solemn conversation of the Gibbs being like, I always had good ideas mm. and they were always shut down and I'm going to be my own man now. Yeah. And we don't need Ludacris even though we may be trying to bring him back to life. That's on the back burner. That's, that's on the back burner. Yeah. Now, I would like to add that I think Jason Momoa has lost his, like, big army somehow. I'm Does not he sure have how... an army? Well, he had an army because oh, he well, was, he like... Oh, he has his, like, friend. Yes. Well, his friend? You know, the, the Oh, guy. yeah, no, but I'm talking about, like, his, like, allegiance of people. Remember how he, like, yeah. kidnapped all their families and yeah. stuff? I'm going to say that Shaw's stopping that. Yeah, that's great. Yeah. I think... Shaw, the the two Shaws. Yes, and right? Helen. And Helen. And you know what? The Rock's not going to Madagascar. No. He's gone to go help Shaw. Oh, huge. Okay, cool. So what? They're like, okay, you go find the egg. We're going to try and save the fa- family. Oh, my God. You've got an idea. Huge, Hit me. A huge concept. Yeah. We all know in Hobbs and Shaw, there are cyborgs, mm. right? Idris Elba's a cyborg. Yeah. So we find out Jason Momoa mm. has been funding cyborg making oh, and it turns out God. his people are cyborgs Huge. right yes and so that's why Shaw and the rock have to go and do this because yeah. it feeds into their their cyborg yeah, storyline it feeds into their cyborg storyline great story great, line, great. Right? Yeah. this is great because you know what it also means mm. if they defeat them it's one of those bad movie decisions where they all just drop dead yes you know wonderful yep yes. okay cool so Jason Moe is like, okay, fuck, do I stop them? I'm going to go chase them. I think he should uh, be holding on to the submarine and sort of like Tom Cruise. <laughs> and when it dives down, he's still able to breathe. But he's holding on to it when they get to Madagascar. Yeah, I he's think that's on. fine. Yeah. Why is he in Antarctica? Um, or has them... Was... They, they've stopped and picked up Dom and the gang. Where were they? They were, were they in Portugal? They were in Portugal. <laughs> okay. Yeah. That's fine. <laughs> the quickest way to Madagascar is by sub. Everyone knows that. I think there's also, again, we need a little bit of humor. Yeah. Right? And we know Jason Momoa's character was a little bit out there. Yeah. Him and his friend, Beefcake. Yeah. Right? Beefcake goes, Shall we take the private jet mm. to Madagascar yeah. to bring your dad back to life? Jason Momoa goes, No, it's quicker if I hold on to a submarine. Yes. They go, Let's wager that bet. Mm-hmm. They've now got a fun little side bet oh, that fun. they can yeah, they can play cheeky. off of the rest of the movie. Oh, that's fun. So who can get there quicker? Who's oh, gonna get there it's quicker? It writes itself. Um and also uh like right now let's solve it. It's the plane. Yeah. <laughs> Very quickly. <laughs> Very quickly. But now there. Jason Momoa's on the tail, you know? Yes, Jason Momoa's okay. So Jason Momoa, he's holding on to the submarine. We're in Madagascar. I feel like we're in the second act now. <sighs> yeah. Yeah. Huge. We need to now figure out. Okay, we need a set piece. Yeah. We need an obstacle. I think the egg gets split into two, something like that. But we need, yes. to, we need and then yes. we need to end with a third act with another set piece. Okay, so, so we've got the middle, the most boring part of the movies. Okay, so we've already had um, a submarine sequence from Fate of the Furious. So we can't actually do an action sequence with a submarine. No. It's been done. It's been done. The audience would hound us. However, you know what hasn't been done? Underwater. Fuck, you're so right. I'm so right. You are so right. Yeah. We've not delved into that depth. Oh, yet. I think we're going to have to have Jason Momoa have his own submarine. Yes. We're getting very close to Aquaman. I think that could be a joke. Maybe he winks to the camera and goes, oh, I'm normally underwater. I'm not a writer, but that's that's pretty <laughs> funny to me. You know? Let's assume um, Jason Momoa does some great improv. Yeah. Write that down. <laughs> 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 okay, so we've got the second act. They're getting to Madagascar. Let's just say they get to Madagascar. Yeah. They need to climb... I don't know. what What's going on here? We need, like, a drug cartel. How about the drug cartel <laughs> from, like, one of the movies has from maybe Miami? The mattress sort of, uh, sort oh, of thing? Oh, oh, this is good. Yes. They've got half the egg. No, I think, actually, the drug cartel yeah. from the fourth one. Yep. The guy who comes back into the sixth one? Yeah. He... Has re- he's gotten out of prison? Yeah. He's back. He's in Madagascar. Yeah. He's got he's got half the egg. Yes. Right. We now learn that, so then we can split off the team. Yeah. But one team has to so let's get this egg. Can we get a picture of what Madagascar? Like the what's the what's the biggest city in Madagascar? Because that's where the action sequence will be set. Visually, what does it look like? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Stunning. Oh, that's quite fun, actually. You know okay. what? I think that could work. Yeah. I think 
Okay, there's been a little bit of like a submarine attack. Yeah. Right? It's a, it's starting to sink. Mm-hmm. They bring they bring the submarine up onto the land. Mm. It's gonna blow up. They drive cars out of the front of the submarine. Oh, I think they drop. I think fuck it. They do like a speed two. They cut the submarine onto land. Yes, you know? yes. That's how it emerges. It yeah. goes right on up onto land. Yeah. This is where a lot of the budget goes. Yeah. They really ruin a lot of Madagascar. Oh, it's absolutely devastating. Like it's a trav. It's a oh, travesty. Exactly. I think Jason Momoa does that. Yes. Jason Momoa yes. does that. He does he that. That's that. the improv. Yes. <laughs> 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 okay, so now we've got okay, we've probably got uh Jason Momoa is in Madagascar. We've got the team. Let's say uh they're sort of driving around, big set piece, he's trying to find them. He's also now gone, I've got cyborgs. So hey cyborgs, get in here yeah. and start some shit. Get get here. This yeah. is when we cut to an additional action sequence yeah. happening where the two shores, Hobbs and Helen. And Helen mm. and Hobbs's daughter. Yes. Right? are all battling cyborgs. They're also in an exotic location. Hit me out. I'll I'll give you one right now. Yep, let's generate another one. They're in Myanmar. They're in Myanmar, right? Okay, (laughs) so they're all fighting in Myanmar. (laughs) Yeah. Um, The... Okay, let's... I'm going to say they release everyone except one person, like one hostage. Okay. Who's a hostage? So you remember how like uh, he's like trapped all their families, and that's how he gets the guards on side. Oh yes, I'm gonna, say, I'm gonna yep. say like sort of the end of the second act. They released everybody, yep. but there's still one person left. Yes, who has been held hostage? Who could that be? Who's restricting that? I'm thinking like Sif is like mum. No, I'm I thinking hate it. conservatively. I hate how what do you we, just said. Hang on, how do we know? Who's birthed Gal and uh, Cypher? Oh my god. Fuck, you are so right. Yeah. And it needs to be an Oscar winning actress. It needs to be. Uh, it's going to be Meryl Streep. What are we going to talk about? I don't know. I think this would be an amazing role for like Oprah. Oh. Do you reckon? Yeah. that's. It has to be someone Oprah of that hasn't caliber. been in a movie in ages. Yeah. Has she won an Oscar? She has, I believe. If, if we can't. Yes, get... she has an ego, I believe. Let's, let's check. Oprah has not won an Oscar. Oh, okay. Well, She's it's... been nominated, so we can't use her. Do she you want Meryl? One. Do you want Meryl? Okay. I'm thinking maybe Whoopi. I think Whoopi actually has won an Oscar. She has. She won she it got... for Ghost. Oh. Do we think we could get Whoopi? We could get Whoopi. So Whoopi is Cypher and Gal Gadot's mum. Oh, well, that makes no sense. <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 no. It does. Whoopi would be good though, because here's be the good. thing: without um, uh, what's it called? Without Ludacris, we're severely lacking in comedy. Oh yeah, right. So <laughs> I think Whoopi's going to Whoopi, need to. Yes, we need a little bit of Whoopi. Maybe she's like ag- agonizing the guards. So when Hobbs and Shaw oh, get there, that'd she's be already great. broken out. That would be good. It's like a little bit, and also there's a little bit of a wink to the camera yeah. as well. She's dressed like a nun. Oh fuck! Okay? <laughs> it's a little bit. It's like a little bit of a Sisters Act three. Bit tongue in cheek. Okay, cool. Just so a little that's... bit. T- and you know what? I'm gonna leave. Let's leave some more room in the. The script for a little bit of improv for her. <laughs> Let's leave that for her as a bit of a treat. All right. Okay. Where are we? There's at? now five Oscar-winning women in this franchise, and I'm so happy for them. Oh god damn. Okay. Let's have a look. Where are we at? So the Shaw and stuff are doing that. Well, yep. they're releasing the people. They're going to say Whoopi Goldberg. We're going to get this egg. I'm going to say half the team splits off to find the other egg, which is actually in. It's in Liechtenstein. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, Who do you want half the team to go? Okay. I think this is where we do like a weird combo. I 100%. Okay. So I think, well, look, we need um, Giselle and Han to chat. So I think those two are going to have to go to Liechtenstein. Yes. I would also say that I want Dom now to hunt down uh, Thingamajig, Jason Momoa. Jason Momoa. I think that's Has Dom main- now got the upper hand? Yes. Is that what we think has happened I after the so. Madagascar action sequence yes. somehow? I want him to now go into a blind rage. Essentially, him on his own in his like, weird car. Oh my black god, car. in this sequence, Letty's killed. Oh, again? Huge. Now right? he wants revenge again. Okay. Yes. But she, but while she dies, she finds out where the other egg is in the Liechtenstein. Oh, yeah. So that's what she goes, I'm... She, this is... Bam. This is yeah. another... This is another power of the egg. Yes. As you were dying, yeah. if you have previously been resurrected <laughs> by the egg, if you are dying, you can visually see on a map <laughs> where the egg is located. Huge, huge, She goes, huge. 
half as here in Madagascar as we knew, <laughs> but Dom, the other half is in Liechtenstein, and she fades away. That's huge. Okay. Right? I, I mean, she also it. says, I'm sorry, but I never emotionally connected to little B, <laughs> and I don't want to have a relationship with I feel with like I child. was a mother, and quite frankly, I blame you. Why'd yeah. you bring him into our home? So that that <laughs> we now know how that ties together. Okay, okay? huge. Okay. So that we're also acknowledging that really Letty's acted weird towards little B for yeah. a lot of movies. Oh yeah, hundred <laughs> okay, percent. So... It's been uncomfortable. Yeah. Okay, we've got Han Gazelle. Who else are we going to Liechtenstein? Okay, so I think I think I think it's hilarious if Vin and Tyrese, to the two of them, are hunting down Jason Momoa. Yes, with his confidence he's yeah, got. With his... Oh, this is really good too, because it means that we can send Beefcake mm. to Liechtenstein. Yes. Right? So there's conflict over there. Yeah. Okay. Um, so that means Giselle. Okay, so Letty's dead. So we've still got... Um, Ramsey. We've still got Ramsey and we've still got Cypher. I think Ramsey and Cypher just hack the stuff in Madagascar. <gasps> yeah. Okay. Have a hack off. They have a hack off. Yes, to That's stop okay. a drug pin. So this is, yeah, so I think they've got the one half of the egg, yes. Yep. And they've both got a hack off to see who can get I'm into it. I'm saying that with this egg is very powerful. It's kind of like yeah. the Infinity Stones. Half yeah. the egg can do ma- magic stuff. Yeah. I think it can control all cars. Oh. Or, or, what else are you thinking? Well, yeah. no, I was thinking if the egg's in half. Yeah. Surely one of them has to stay with one half of the egg oh. and one of them has to go for after the other half of the egg because usually you would have to join them together to yeah. resurrect from the afterlife. But this time they're able to hack them together. Oh, huge. And Ramsey's like whole character arc is becoming a better hacker. She's lost Ludacris, her mentor maybe. Yeah. The only love of her life. Yeah. But now doors are open for Tyrese potentially. It's a win. It's a win. Also, we're still at this sort of question where characters have been getting killed off all movie. Yeah. But they can only resurrect one. Yeah. Who is it going to be? Oh, and it's going to be a twist. Yeah, it's going because we've lost Ludacris. Yeah. Even lost then, there's killed off screen. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we've lost Letty. Oh, I hope we don't lose any more. We might. We might. Okay. okay. So they've gone to Liechtenstein. We and we've had. Okay. So we need like a little set piece. Oh, okay. So this is this is what I'm thinking. Sorry. Yeah. Cipher, Gibbs, Vin. Yeah. Ramsey, Giselle, and Han. Yes. And I, I think that's fun because she doesn't know those no, two. No, <laughs> I think that is good. Uh, dare I say, no, I want Dom to be on his own, on his own hunting Jason Momoa. Oh, okay. So okay. we've got Gibbs and Cypher. I think that's insane. We've never seen those two together and I think they would thrive. I think it would also be a lot of fun for Cypher mm. to then show Gibbs a picture of her mum <laughs> <laughs> and say... Me and oh, this is where we also find out that they're sisters, yes. Giselle and her. And the Gibbs is like, okay, that's really weird. Yeah. Again, ripe for comedy. Yeah. Um, He's got a beat. He's, he's using it. Yeah. They get to Liechtenstein. Yeah. They realize they need a bigger team. Yeah. They get Twinkie. They get Twinkie. They get Sean. They also yeah. get who are we thinking? We get the two guys who were in the fifth film. Those two Mexican oh, yes, guys. Oh yes, yes, the two guys from the fifth film. Yeah, and also who's the girl that we love from the second one? Oh, she's great. In it, and they never use her again. Um, it's not Eva Mendes, is it? No, no. The um... oh, oh, wait, from the second one? Yeah. Oh, it's um Stevie Oki's sister. Yes, yeah, yes. Yeah. She's back in it. Yeah, she's back in it. Oh, actually, you know what? This person's also been killed off. Uh, Twinkie's also been killed off screen. Yeah. So that um, Lucas Black has somebody he wants to save. Yes, he wants to save. Well. Everyone's kind of got like a person they need to get in. Yeah. So they're in Liechtenstein. Oh, the same with one of the other um, of the of those brothers or twins or whatever. Yes. One yes, of them one is dead. One, one, of them, dead. <laughs> one of them has died off. They were too. camping where the plane crashed. It That's burned true. them all. Yeah. It wasn't they, nice. all, they also go to tease you with a flashback. Yeah. <laughs> to make you think you're about to see how any of these other people have died. It just cuts back to another IMAX shot. <laughs> <laughs> of ludicrous. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we've got the Liechtenstein scene. Okay, we've got the Madagascar. They're still kind of figuring out the drug dealer. We've got yep. Dom. Dom's uh, hunting down Jason hunting, Momoa. Who's now fled to... <laughs> <laughs> the Dominican Republic. Love it. Okay, okay. What a film. <laughs> Shaw and uh, Thingamajig have now uh, saved Wookiee Goldberg and they're like, let's hunt down Jason Momoa. They've turned the cyborgs on their side. Oh my God, huge. 
Um, this is this is where it's revealed that the shadowy figure from the end of Hobbs and Shaw mm. was Jason Momoa. Yep. That's neat. Yep. Yeah, I think so. I think that ties it well. Um, now, Jason Momoa is down for the count. We're thinking, how the hell can this guy, you know, win, essentially? So who has the half at the moment? So I'm going to say, um, although Dom is hunting him down the Dominican Republican, he's actually tricked him to Jason Momoa. He's stolen the egg in Liechtenstein. Okay, now he's got the one up, but who's in the Dominican Republic? Who? I don't know. We need, <laughs> we, we need to figure this one how out. How have we thinned Who, out this, how this, we, this group? Dare I say, we need an arc, because it's the last one. Yeah. I think we need, like, you know, an Avatar The Last Airbender sort of thing. Dom goes to the, Dominic, <laughs> the Dominican Republic. He now needs to be granted a power. You can't spell Dominican Republic <laughs> without <laughs> Dom. <laughs> I think Dom needs to be, although he's hunted him, he finds like an ancient car church and he's actually the deity of this oh said church. Oh my God. The, the sacred mechanic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Who's also going to be played by an Oscar winning actress. Oh God. Who could it be? Who could it possibly be? We've already used Meryl, but I think we need a We Meryl. haven't used Meryl, oh, but do- she's won too many Oscars. Yes. In my opinion. Do you think they could deep fake Catherine Hepburn? <laughs> We haven't used Brie Larson yet. <laughs> oh, cool. Do you think Brie Larson actually is on top of it being a very secret, secret organization? It's just a big reveal. She's also the owner of the car mechanics. Yeah. Oh, and she's trying to bring Mr. Nobody back to life oh, as well. Oh my Her god. Her dad. Huge. Fuck, we're so good at this. <laughs> we're so goddamn good at this. So good. Okay. But now Brie Larson has granted Dom a power. Yeah. Now I think he can either use the, the egg golden to- wrench. Oh. <laughs> he can actually use that egg. To do something else, the egg. We don't know what the egg does. Though. I hate this. No, 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 no. Don't complicate the egg. Oh, oh. The audience can't handle it. They're gonna have to because it's gonna be a great MacGuffin. Okay. Is it gonna be a great MacGuffin? Sell me on it. Why? I think something can happen with this wrench. Okay, fine. Okay, he's yeah. now got the golden wrench, half egg. Yeah. And Brie Larson. Yes. But he's also hunting down Jason Momoa, who has the other half of the egg. Wait. So why have they gone to Liechtenstein? Because they tried to get the egg and it was there, but then Jason Moe stole it. How did he get it? He, a set piece, okay? But he, he was in Madagascar. No, no, he's fled. He's gone over there. Because he thought, Dom thought he was running to the Dominican Republican. He wasn't actually there. Keep up. <laughs> so you're saying mm. after they were in Madagascar yeah. and the team splintered off, yeah. Jason Momoa went to Dominic- wait, went to Liechtenstein. Yes, but he actually pretended he was going to the Dominican Republic. To so trick Dom, Dom. Okay, so, okay. So then, okay, so an action set piece has happened in Liechtenstein. Yes. So who got the half of the egg in Madagascar? Uh, I believe it was Ramsey and um, who else was with Ramsey? Okay, so Ramsey, Han, and Giselle have half an egg. Yeah. They've gone to Liechtenstein to join. No, because this is why we split off Cypher and the Gibbs. Yes. So Cypher and the Gibbs are holding onto the egg in Madagascar. Yep. They're just kind of having a bit of banter. Do we like they are banter? again? They're having they're having great banter. Yeah. I think we all know the Chili's Theron and Tyrese, Tyrese Gibson Gibbs. would get along fantastic I think in a comedy. So, yeah. I think it's yeah. ripe. I think it's very ripe. Pick it, pick it if you need to. It's getting over ripe on the tree. <laughs> um, okay, so Jason Momoa has gone to Liechtenstein. Yep, they've had a set piece. Yep. Um, I think uh, in terms of other vehicles that have wheels. They have an action sequ- sequence that involves... We've got a train, we've got planes. School got buses. A... Oh, yeah, okay. What do we think? I think Jason Momoa has, like, hacked the school buses, so then, you know, they have to save the kids or save the egg. He saves the egg and the school children survive somehow. Yes. Or all the school children die. And or... now all those parents want the egg. Oh, yeah, true. <laughs> no, that's too much. That's too, too much. much. I yeah. hate it. It's getting complicated. We now need to tie this all back together. Okay. Where can the egg be activated? Other than the egg can only be activated on a mountain in Cyprus. Cyprus. We have to go to Cyprus, a small island under Turkey. Which is where Cypher was born. Yes. And she's named after it. <laughs> <laughs> That's right. Wookie, Wookie Goldberg, Goldberg is originally is from, from Cyprus. Cyprus. Okay, everyone's coming together. Okay. Jason Momoa knows they're going to go to Cyprus to activate the egg. They also know that Jason and Moe's going to go to Cyprus to activate the egg. So they all travel to to, to Cyprus to oh, activate the egg. Also, I think during this time, 
Beefcake has been killed by yes. somebody. Let's say Ramsey shot him. Yeah. Um. Okay, so let's go through. Yeah. They are all going to join up together because I think they've turned The Rock, The Shores, and Helen Mirren and all mm. that. They come to Cyprus yeah. to help out. Yes. With all with Whoopi of, Goldberg. With Whoopi Goldberg. Yeah. With all of the turned cyborgs. Yes. Yes. But then Jason Momoa turns the cyborgs on them. Yeah. So that Jason Momoa now has like an army. Yeah. And then we're able to have like our Avengers shot. Yes. With Vin Diesel with his golden wrench. Yeah. Brie Larson. Mm. Uh, Han. Han. We got, we got. Uh, Giselle. Giselle Ramsey. Sure. Sure. Helen Merrin. We got Whoopi Goldberg. We got the Dwayne The Rock Johnson. We've got Lil B and Brian is also there. Kind of obscure. Nope. I was going to say the golden wrench to bring Paul Walker back. <laughs> no, <laughs> don't back. like it. No. Uh, we so got? we've also got... Uh, the two Mexican guys. We've got... A no, shot no, of, one of them's dead. One of them's dead. One we've got a shot dead. of Ludacris' dead corpse. We still need to remind you. It's a rule of sevens. It's sprinkled in a clot. Yep. So we've also got... Um, fuck. Uh, so we've also got uh, Lucas Black from the third one. Yeah. We've got... The second uh, one. Aoki. Yeah. We've got... Um, oh, fuck. Who else? Rita Moreno. Yeah. Uh, this is where Mia comes back. Yeah, Mia's um, back Mia's there. Mia's here now. A picture of John Cena's there saying, I couldn't be. I was filming season three of a show. A peacemaker. A peacemaker. <laughs> um, uh, the, oh, who else is there? There's so many. Let's start bringing back all of the angry police from the first movie. They're there with, yes. their, with their cappuccinos. Oh, they're not happy. And they're so frothy. And um, they're decaffeinated. It's just a real sprawling shot yeah. where you go, wow, there's really a lot of them. Yeah. I feel like there's a party also happening, a car drive by yes. meetup. Yes, so this is also where we get our sexy shot of oh, everybody yeah. dancing on cars. Yes. Right? So um, we also, get, that's a tick. Yep, tick's so done. done. So they've now got the full egg. No, Jason Momoa has half an egg, yes, right? Yes, they're okay. like, hey, we know we both all have an army, but should we have a 14-man quarter-mile race? Yes. <laughs> yes. I'm as, saying... As we know... Cyprus uh, is famous for its long, winding roads. This is going to be huge. And here's the kicker. To yeah. save money, we've shot it all in LA. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. They put this on pause. Go to LA to do this race. <laughs> we've got to take... Yes, yes. Yeah. And Jason Momoa was like, yes, let's do it. And Vin's like, but I get to pick the street. Yes. Goes to the original street from the first... The Fast and the Furious yeah. film. This is where they are all going to they're race. They're all lined up. There's like 20 cars, like three cyborgs, Han. Everyone is in a car. You've never seen a road so wide yeah. or so many cars. Because <laughs> I still think that one of the best action sequences is when all the cars are revealed in oh, the second Fast and Furious. there's going to be so many cars. Okay. This race begins. Yep. Carnage ensues. Yes. It's insane. We've never seen anything like it. It is all done for real. All practical effects. Yes. People are crashing, people are dying, but Dom and Jason Moe are still at the They're front. They're the final two. Yes. They are the final two racing towards... Again, oh. all the carnages happened over. I can't stress this enough. One quarter of a mile. <laughs> ten seconds. It's the, it's intense. This is We slow the ten seconds down to 30 minutes. Yeah, it's a long 30 minutes. And it's a one take. Oh, it's stunning. Now, and Carl, it's all practical. Carl, now how the hell is Dom going to win this race? Vin is losing. The egg is at the end of the finish line. Jason Moe's about to grab it. Carl, what does Vin do? He looks down in his car. Yes. There's Nos. Oh, shit. It won't turn on. Oh, no. Something is loose <laughs> and needs to be tightened. <laughs> What does he use? <laughs> he goes under the seat, rummages around, holds the golden screw, the golden spanner, tightens a little knob, and oh my the god. Nos fucking Whoa. takes off. <laughs> it's a huge moment. I also think maybe in this moment he looks to his right and uh, Brie Larson gives him a nod. She's dead, by the way. She's now a ghostly figure. She's yeah. kind of like... She's the ancient mechanic. Oh, she's done it. He flies in, grabs yeah. the egg. Jason Momoa 
stunned. He also throws the golden wrench at his face. Yeah. He flies off. He dies. He's dead. And it is, again, Cut really tasteful. back to ludicrous. <laughs> <laughs> oh, man, the IMAX shots are stunning. <laughs> Just stunning. Oh, in Portugal, in the oh, mountains of Portugal, God. they're a damn beautiful. Okay, now here's the big thing. So Jason Moe's dead. Everyone's back. Vin has the egg. Who's what? he going to bring back to life? I think I have an idea of who I think he should bring back to life. I've got some gag ideas. I'm thinking Twinkie. I'm thinking. I'm thinking <laughs> one of the Mexican brothers. He looks at how sad Lucas Black is <laughs> and old. <laughs> Oh, man. I think... I think because we've established... A, a, so, like, again, you know, screenwriting. you got to pay off what yeah. you set up. We know at the core of all these movies is Dominic and Letty. Yeah. And we killed Letty off mid-film. Mm. Okay. And we know when nobody's picking Ludacris. <laughs> <laughs> so. The Quintus roll over his face. I want that to be the thing. <laughs> do, 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 do. Um... And we know that if you're resurrected by the egg, yeah. you get a superpower. Oh, huge. right. Yes. He picks Letty. Massive. Right? What is her power? What's her power? She says, Can you give me the power to love little B? <laughs> little B runs up to Dom, but he spots Letty. He goes, Oh, she was kind of weird to me for a while. <laughs> Letty kind of gives him a look, though, like, hey, I've accepted you as who you are. I'm not weird anymore. <laughs> Opens her hands for a hug. They all hug. Oh, this is, okay, yes, huge. Yeah. Letty opens her hands for a hug. Mm. Little B hugs her. Yeah. Dominic hugs them. Mm. Slowly. All oh, of the other characters. Everyone's picking they off. Are, Fucking a crawling over bodies to try and get to that hug. It's a huge Oh, yeah, hug. they're doing wrong. The car Carnage. wrecks ma- manic. <laughs> Shaw lost his legs. Dwayne's impaled. It's an absolute nightmare. Oh, we definitely lost Dwayne. <laughs> <laughs> we de- he definitely died. Not sacrificing himself. Yeah. He just didn't. We de- see Shaw post Hobbs. <laughs> <laughs> they all hug. Now we can go two routes. Does the power of love like bring everyone back, or do they just go to a barbecue sponsored by Corona? It's clearly the barbecue. <laughs> <laughs> they and you know they have a beautiful meal. Yeah. Um, and then they 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 turn and they look at all of the framed faces of everyone that that's died over the franchise. Yes, yes. A, a Desperate Housewives season finale, if you will. <laughs> they sort of drive around LA, that shitty street, and the, everyone that's died is wearing a white gown. <laughs> I think it's just Dom in a room mm. with a picture of everybody that's fallen. Yeah. You know what? Let's just say there's like a class photo-esque oh, picture sorry. of all of them. I know we've already picked the title, but it's The Fall of the Furious. <laughs> oh, <laughs> So good. Okay, Fall of the Furious. Yeah. Amazing title switch. We're there, we're there. Amazing title switch. Here's the thing, switch. you never think of the title first. You have to oh, make the story, you do, then you, you pick go- a title. You've, you've got to. Yeah. You've absolutely got to. Dominic is by himself with a corona. Yeah. There is a lime in it. Mm. It's perfectly tempered. Mm. A little bit of sweat coming off that Corona. Oh, it's come out of ice. Fuck, we, right? we buy Frankly, some? it looks amazing. <laughs> You've never seen Corona look this good on screen. In fact, it's the only other shot apart from Ludacris that's in IMAX. <laughs> <laughs> the opacity there. Both shots just kind of blue. But go on, yes. Okay, he's looking at the wall of everybody that's fallen. He sips his Corona. Oh, I'm trying to think. He you, sips his Corona. You want, you want a punchy line to finish on? I just thought maybe it was like a... I think? think he just sort of, and I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say right now, Vin Diesel has a lot of producing power. I think he's allowed to improvise a monologue, <laughs> and I think it's a mess. He's kind of mixing in when you live a quarter of the mile of the time, and you lose your ones you love your most. Well, that's when you gotta drive, and the streets never win. Oh. But you know who does win? Me. <laughs> <laughs> I think maybe it should just be like. We weren't furious, but we were fast. <laughs> Sips that drink, cut to credits. Oh my god! I think, like, I that's think. really beautiful. Yeah, I think that's really. Beautiful. I'm tearing up thinking about the corona. <laughs> it's the sweat, you know. You just want to have a little sip. Oh, oh. god, it looks tantalizing. 
And um, then they also got uh, Charlie Puth black back for uh, like a remix or something. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's uh, not as good, but you know, it's not it's, as good, but it's a hit. Yeah, you know, you know, it's a win. So you know, Wiz has a line in it. Yeah, he has a little rap. <laughs> yeah, no, he does that. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> um, Carl. I mean, wh- wh- Hollywood. Uh oh, bring bring. <laughs> they yeah. don't want us there. Don't want the script. Yeah. Oh man, what a huge. To think that was 58 minutes. Wow. <laughs> Fuck me dead. Crazy the film's also four and a half hours long. Oh, That's canon. But he, I really cannot stress this enough to everybody. It's very slowly paced. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's uneven. It's, it's very it's awkward. Totally uneven. There's a reason it got 30% on Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> it is, it's a real fucking mess. Um, wow. Um, post credit sequence. Um... Han and Giselle never said anything to each other. Should we, <laughs> should we have something there? No, no, no. I think they kind of both look at each other and go, I, I, I just think th- it'd be funny. I, I don't think this works. I don't think we should work. I think it'd be hol- It's been a while since we, uh, we've changed a lot. Just Han looking at Giselle being like, you all right? <laughs> yep. All right. Cut to black. Yeah. <laughs> Cut to Lucas Black. <laughs> <laughs> Oh man! Well, that's fast. Uh, f- the, the fall of the furious. Oh, yeah. great name. Um. Okay. Let's. Okay. Let's just quickly tie things up. Um. It. It. Look. It. It did cost four hundred and fifty million dollars. I yep. reckon that's about another hundred million on top of what Fast X costed. Yep. Um. It didn't break a bill. It probably didn't break a bill. No, I reckon it topped out at about seven hundred and fifty million. Oofed. Uh. The studio said. And that's not great for you us. You guys filmed in such weird locations that we could not sell this to anyone. The Cyprenese audience kind of liked it, but no. they were mixed on it. Not many people live there. The test audience only loved the scene where Giselle, <laughs> Cypher, and Ruby Goldberg were reunited. And that was it. <laughs> a teardrop in like a stream of piss. <laughs> that's, what they, that's how they described it. So Ellie Weekly described it as a hot mess, but yeah. Whoopi nails it. Oh yeah, but here's the kicker. Rolling Stones love the film. <laughs> five out of five. Oh, Carl. Anything to add? Um, yeah, who would who would watch this? <laughs> who would watch this? Let's figure this out now. Okay. I mean, it's the final one. I think everyone's going to turn out for I it. I think so. I mean, not uh, not money wise though. Yeah. It seems it didn't make that much money. But uh. I think I think if you if it genuinely was the last one, it's going to make a bill and a half. I think it might. I think it would just crack a bill. I don't think this one's like the Fast X is making a bill. So yeah. I don't. I think this would get a little bit of a kicker. Um, look, I, after explaining it, I, I wouldn't watch it. No, it sounds, uh, it sounds awful, terrible. Dreadfully paced. Yeah. I don't think many characters pay off. I don't think the final product will be that different from this podcast. Isn't it crazy we killed off quite a few people? I mean, there's still <laughs> so, so many, many characters. Like, <laughs> oh, fuck, God. I can't. God damn it. Yeah. yeah. It was a really beautiful experience. Yeah. Um, if you enjoyed this, mm. I don't know why. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, right in <laughs> shit on them fuck you yeah. why would you let us do this why we just didn't you? we didn't want to watch a movie huh? what would you have wanted to happen in, yes, fa- in, in yes. Fall of e- the Furious email us in if you got predictions for Fast 11 the Fall of the Furious <laughs> at www.podcast at gmail.com god Maybe. I wish we had a soundboard uh, we just did I just pressed it <laughs> <laughs> Oscar, what are we reviewing next week? Next week, Carl, uh, we're fucking done with cars. We're fucking they're, they're done. I never want to see a car I'm, again. I'm in a straight film. up will be ending it all if I see a car. Even two wheels is a bit too much. Too for me. much. We're like, fuck it, we're going straight to the water. Carl, we're digging up we're we're going for Disney for the jugular, you know? We're doing the Little Mermaid 2. Return to the Sea. <laughs> That's right, the two thousand classic, the sequel that no one watched except us. Except us. Excited to talk about it. <laughs> Sounds like a stirring film of adventure and music. <laughs> Thank you for listening. <laughs> nice. <laughs> no, you know what, man? I'm gonna let you land there. What was the? Yeah, I mean, you could cut it off there. Wouldn't it be funny if that was a sound bite. You could just play that any time at the end. Who? 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 That's a, that's an episode, surely. 